Hi guys, my name is Anish Ahmed and I love creating 3D photo realistic renders. And today I have created this beautiful scene in Blender, rendered it out using cycles with keeping the denoising data and the mist pass on. And I'm going to show you how you can composite this scene and save it without re-rendering it out. So now I have rendered this scene, it's done and it took around hour and a half to complete because I increased the samples and as you can see it still has a lot of noise around here so we're gonna remove this using the compositor we'll also add some final tweaks to make it look really amazing let's quickly go to the compositing tab here turn on use notes and we don't want this timeline so I'm gonna remove it okay so here we have these two nodes the render layer and composite now I'm gonna quickly add a viewer node so we can see what we are working on and I'm just gonna connect these two image to image I'm gonna also enable the backdrop so now here we have our render you can click the viewer node and uh, you can scale it however you want but I'm gonna just keep it like this for now now to remove the noise that we have in our render as you can see right here we're gonna quickly add a denoise so I'm just gonna make some space and I'm gonna add a denoise I'm gonna just put it here and I'll connect these two image to image and as you can see it's taking some time to composite I'm gonna connect these two as well and now what we have to do is we have to connect this image noisy image to image this normal to normal and then the albedo to the albedo one and now we're gonna let it composite for a few seconds and here we go all the noise that we used to have in our render is now gone amazing now our render looks great so i'm gonna add one more note before saving it now i'm gonna just make some space around here and i'm gonna add a node that is called glare so I'm just gonna put this right in between these two like this and now we need to just wait I'm just gonna change the uh, this type to fog glow and I'm also gonna change this to high uh, now we don't need to touch this mix but the threshold we're gonna keep it at around 0.3 and now what we as you can see we cannot see our glare working right now because uh, we haven't connected it to the viewer node so now what I'm gonna do is just connect these two right here image to image and we're going to wait for a few seconds and uh, and there you go now you have some really good looking realistic glow to the scene like it's a dreamy sunset kind of feeling so that's looking pretty amazing now we want to save this but we don't want to re-render it out so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open a screen right here 
and I'm gonna change it to the image editor and we're gonna open render result and there you go there you have it what we just composited is right here right now and what we need to do is just go to the image and save it and there you go you don't have to re-render it out just like that I'm gonna name it something like render and I'm gonna save it as image and there you go that's all thanks for watching this video that's all in this video uh, if you like this please subscribe to my channel as I put lots of videos about this topic and yeah just stay tuned for more peace out